Robert from Action Corrosion. Firstly, I'd like to thank you for taking interest in our Action Gel, which is our premium rust remover. It comes in a 500 mils, it comes in one litre, and your 2.5 litres. Action Gel is a phosphoric acid based product and is one of only a few worldwide with a gel consistency. The good news is it's made right here in Australia. The key to a successful metal restoration project is rust removal rather than relying totally on rust conversion. The problems associated with relying on just a rust converter is that if you put too much of the product on, it leaves an acidic surface. If you don't put enough on, it doesn't go through the layers of rust and convert all the rust, which means later on rust can pop through a coating that you put over the top. It's for this reason that products that are purely converters are not permitted in some areas of steel construction. The primary role of Action Gel is as a rust remover with the added benefit of leaving a beneficial paintable surface as per your standard rust converters. So the benefit of the gel is it's going to remove those layers of rust and not have the problems associated with just relying on conversion. To demonstrate how effective Action Gel is when compared to leading rust converters, we do a lot of in-house testing. This is one of those tests. This rusted piece of mould still will firstly have a popular hardware chain's leading rust converter applied to the right hand side of it. As you can see when it's applied, it's a watery texture and tends to run off the surface very quickly. Next, Action Gel is applied to the left hand side of this panel using a paintbrush. You'll see that Action Gel's thicker formula keeps it in contact with the rusted surface for longer. This allows it to do its job as a rust remover. After three minutes, the action gel appears to be dissolving the rust, whereas the converter seems to be drying on the surface. After six and a half minutes, the panel is rinsed off to show you how each product fared. If you look at the left hand side of the panel where the action gel was applied, the rust has pretty much been totally removed. There was only small areas of pitting where there was conversion to iron phosphate. Whereas if you look at the right hand side of the panel where the rust converter was applied, there was very little rust removal, but large areas of conversion to iron phosphate. In our experience with structures, we've always found that rust removal gives a better outcome than rust conversion. Action Gel is a phosphoric acid based product. We recommend the use of gloves, especially if you have cuts on your hands, and glasses to prevent splashing in the eyes. If you do get Action Gel on your skin, don't panic. It generally takes about 10 minutes before you get any symptoms. And then it's just a case of rinsing it off with water to totally remove the gel. Before using this product, please read the directions of use and the first aid measures on the rear of the label. Action Gel is generally perfect to use on all steel and stainless steel surfaces, but we do ask that you test the product in an inconspicuous spot to determine its suitability for your project. If you use an Action Gel above a timber deck or any other hard surface, use a tarp to collect any product that may drip down alternatively wet down the area and continue to rinse the product off the surface. Remove oil, grease and flaking paint from the surface to be treated to allow Action Gel to do its job. The length of time gel is required on a surface will vary depending on the depth of the rust and the surface being treated. However, generally at least 30 minutes is required. There are two ways of applying Action Gel. The first one is by submerging the rusted object in a bath of gel. The second is by brushing it on very thick on steel, walls, tiles and driveways. The benefit of using gel as a bath is there will be total rust removal to a bare metal finish and the gel can be decanted and used over and over. If brushing action gel on metals, tiles, walls and driveways, do not allow it to dry on the surface. Once it's done its job, rinse off thoroughly with water.
This is a short clip showing how action gel can be used as a bath. I'm removing heavy rust on this brake rotor. So you can see there's years and years of rust on this. In this demonstration, a support post has been galvanised, but the base plate has not been galvanised, it's been welded on on site. This is a common rust problem we find in coastal locations. The action gel was brushed on thick on half of the base plate. After 10 minutes, you can see that the weld itself is perfectly clean. After 20 minutes, most of the rust has been dissolved. After 35 minutes, the rust has been removed. There has been some conversion in the deeper pitting. It's rinsed off, allowed to dry, and now it's ready for an oil base primer. The cabinets of external compressor units on domestic air conditioners generally have big problems with rust due to their role and their location. This cabinet was de-rusted in 10 minutes using Action Gel. Once the product is rinsed off and the surface allowed to dry, we apply Action Clear Coat for ongoing protection. As this series of photos will show you, heavy corrosion on stainless steel is easily removed with Action Gel. In all these instances, Action Clear Coat was applied after the rust removal for ongoing protection. This next clip shows action gel being used to take rust staining off a wall. This process is exactly the same for rust stain removal of driveways, tiles and walls.
once again, thanks for taking the time to watch our instructional video on Action Gel. We're sure that you're going to be really happy with the performance of the product. At Action Corrosion, we've seen firsthand the damage that rust and corrosion can cause to your property. If you're building or renovating, be sure to download our free Action Corrosion Build Smart Guide. It has 36 pages of design and product advice, as well as tips with regard to corrosion protection of your most valuable asset. Thank you.